Oh, welcome back my uh, gardening friends. Um, I've got an unboxing. Uh, I've been contacted by uh, Mars uh, Hydro uh, with some LED lights. These are the SP150s. I had a look at them and I thought yes they'd look nice in my grow room. So I said to the company that I would agree to their terms and do the unboxing as the uh, first video and uh, getting it set up. I've removed my address and uh, unfortunately this is take two uh, because of uh, some issues but this all comes from Amazon and as you know with all Amazon boxes we get lots and lots of uh, bits of packaging for sometimes a very small box inside. So we've opened this up, it clearly states uh, it's fragile and nice good strong box. So inside we've got the, the foam that we don't always like but we can always try and uh, make use of. The lights of course. clips, uh, extra packaging there, this is where all the extras go, we have all the warranty cards and all the other paraphernalia that goes uh, with it, um, three year warranty, seven days return policy and I must admit guys you're not talking to a machine, you're talking to a person and uh, we've had uh, quite a few conversations so if you do get any issues with these lights they are very very uh, helpful. So we've got the two hanging clips in this bag comes the little pulley systems, now I have seen these pulley systems before They do seem to work well, never tried them myself so we're going to see shortly and in the description below is all the links that you need for wherever you live in the world so make sure you select the right one because you need to make sure you get the right plug. Uh, and so I've wrapped uh, these back up again because of the earlier issues but everything including these comes nice, uh, nicely tied together in those uh, packages. Uh, it's a nice steel top structure with lots of ventilation there for any heat that's generated and uh, this is the first time I've really looked at uh, LED lights so I'll be really uh, really uh, excited to uh, give these a try in the actual grow room. No damage, everything seems to be there. The, uh, the hooks, it doesn't really s sort of say where the hooks go but that's where I'm uh, presuming and let's uh, have a little look in the grow room and see where we're going to put these. So these are the lights at the moment, the T5s uh, with the tubes, uh, everybody seems to be swaying towards LED these days and there's the bulb which I've switched off so you can actually see it that I've had on this side of my grow room. So I'm sure there's going to be enough room there so let's get this set up and then I'll bring you back. Now we've got absolutely plenty of uh, rope there to make it easy and uh, whoops yeah just keep hold the rope but it's so uh, easy just to uh, adjust and I can do the final one 
when it's uh, spot on but if I was to put this in the greenhouse grow room then I would be able to drop it down and uh, raise it up as much as I like and we can just tidy this up and then use those little bits of wire that came with uh, in the box uh, to uh, tie them up so let's uh, get this uh, switched on uh, I'm going to uh, move you slightly so that I can get uh, get round as you can see at the moment uh, the uh, the light that um, the uh, T5 tubed light is giving off and then we'll have a little look see what these LEDs look like and I must say I am really impressed with the amount of light uh, given off ideal for vegetables and flowers a bit of a mix so whatever you've got growing in those uh, little grow rooms and if it does throw out a bit more heat then that will help uh, with the heating costs um, from my heater but no I'm really pleased with those and the tomatoes there are all from the overwintering that we sliced up bar from these are the ones uh, the champion dwarf stock that we just put into an open container and they just went to a rotten smelly uh, mush and uh, like most people said yes they would grow pleased with those I only want a few uh, these are my saved seeds so they may not come true but we'll leave that uh, under those uh, for a few days and then as my giant tomatoes start to um, germinate and grow I'll be doing a little a few parts on these lights so that uh, we can see how they do compared with the T5s so if you're actually interested in having a look at these pop down into the description below um, pick the ones that are from uh, your country your area uh, these are the SP 150s and they're from Mars Hydro and uh, as I say the telephone uh, the email communication has been second to none very prompt on replying uh, at least by the following day with the uh, the uh, the clocks and time scale of wherever we live oh, so thanks very much for watching uh, my friends uh, if you're new to my channel and you want to see how uh, these uh, LED lights get on then uh, please consider subscribing uh, always hit the uh, like button or dislike we don't mind and uh, put a comment in uh, have you used these before uh, I'll be uh, really uh, interested uh, to know and like I say um, during the next uh, few reviews and the test on this uh, we'll be doing three and then there will be a competition but uh, remember to watch to the end of my videos because I won't announce when I'm going to say the competition is it'll be at the end of one of these videos and if I uh, like these lights then I would really like to offer my viewers uh, the chance uh, to win a set happy gardening to you all till next time my friends Tarana, Tara for now All shy. Hello. Hello. Go on, speak for Joyce. <laughs>